70 meters. In this we're seeing Rebound returning, going over this distance. She's one that has won at this distance. In the absence of Tara of Tara and Vasi Bala, Midnight Thomas Dean, I think that the stage is set for her to register another win. Yeah, well, she is coming back in a little better off in the race uh, as she was last time. But our sales player here is top 40. He's very consistent and uh, he's also been long overdue for me. Top 40 perhaps, but rebound I think will benefit from the going this afternoon by Boomerang and uh, she certainly will stay every yard of the 15-17. But we'll see how they go. That's right, um, it drops from um, I'm hoping it does go as well. I don't know much about it, but I'm um, it seems to be a pretty decent horse. I'm just hoping for the lucky race it does go as well. Okay, best of luck. Get back safe. Horse number one is top 40, ridden by Quincy Welch and taking 120 pounds. I'm going out to the race right now is horse number two, Rebo, Jonathan Jones Rice, 120 pounds. Right. Horse number four, Bylamoth, Anderson Ward, riding, 122 pounds. On the way to the start is horse number three, Benny Vidi Vici, Bill Whitaker riding, 123 pounds. And here we have Crowns of 57 years and their ascent racing by starter Mark Batson. And uh, all well away, the bone being squeezed out of it a little bit. And onto the main course they come with top 40 leading. On the outside, Benny Vidi Vici is pulling double. Along the inside is Rebound and Bynamoth is a trailer. Very tiny bunch part as the pass is down for the first time in the circuit to run. Round the pile of better top 40 lead. Now on the inside is Rebound. Benny Vidi Vici is up on the outside. Bynamoth is, is last at this point, but not too far off the lead. They run down towards the fight below marker now. And top 40 begins to stretch out a little bit, opening up by about a length and a half from Rebound. Benny Vidi Vici is on the outside as Bynamoth takes closer order along the rails. They've got a half mile to travel now, and top 40 still leads. He's in front by about a length and a half. From Rebound and Benny Vidi Vici, Bailamoth is being pushed along by Andy Ward. They begin a, a side the hill now and top 40 leads, but being asked a question now by Rebound, and this causes the rhythm to quicken a bit. It's Rebound who goes on now by half a length from top 40. On the outside, Bailamoth is getting into it, Benny Vidi Vici is last. They've got a quarter mile to go now, and the leader is Rebound. She's opening up by two and a half lengths now from on the inside, top 40. On the outside by the Lamotta, Benny Vidi Vici trails. And they're at the top of the lane and rebound the Zane Command. Rebound in front by two and a half from on the outside by the Lamotta. Along the inside, top 40 of Benny Vidi Vici. But start the showers. This was history. Rebound. A superb performance by a superb racehorse. Winning it now is Jonathan Jones from Benny Vidi Vici by the Lamotta and top 40. And here comes the winner of the sixth race, the Sunset Restates and Trophy, horse number two, Rebound. Rebound was written by Jonathan Jones and took along 120 pounds. You have the presentation of the trophy for the Sunset Restates and Trophy. The trophy presented by Mr. and Mrs. Michael Tabor, Mr. Charles Glenn, his wife, Lady Williams, doing the honors of receiving the